YouTube, it's your girl Tasty Redbone. I am here because I am sad. I am sad to report that my beloved Beauty Curls Daily Hair Conditioner has been discontinued. Now, this is the conditioner that I am going to sadly, sadly miss. It's this one right here. This one is the daily hair conditioner that um, retails for $14. Um, although it is a conditioner, I have been using it as a leave-in. Now, as a leave-in, it has worked great. This was going to be, I normally pick in two, so this was one of my top two holy grail leave-ins that I now have to say goodbye to. Um, so I am rather disappointed. Now, the smell... I'm not going to open this one. This is a new jar. I just wanted to show you the jar. And this is the one I'm currently working on. So I put the little pump top on it. This is from the KBV hair milk one that I finished. So I took their pump top and I put it in this. Now, um, the smell of this is the nice strawberries and cream. It smells delicious. Oh my God, it smells great. And, okay, so this is the consistency. Can I just see it run? Yeah. Oh, that's the consistency of that one. And when I put it on my hair, you know, it makes my hair feel soft and moisturized. And um, it keeps it hydrated when I'm at the gym. Yes, I go to the gym. <laughs> um, you know, on my little elliptical machine or what have you. It, it does what it's supposed to do. And um, I really don't use it as a conditioner. I pr primarily use it as a leave-in. And it worked great for me. I could put, you know, my little oil and silicone on top. And the smell was just, oh, heavenly. Now, um, since that one is being discontinued, Marsha has um, given us a replacement. The replacement is the Beauty Curls, the I Argan Oil and Olive Oil. Uh, daily hair conditioner and I have tried using this as a leave-in and I have tried um, Shampooing with this ignore the tape. I've tried it. I just I open it to get more stuff out um, Right off the bat My strawberry scent is gone y'all it is gone. Oh my god that hurts my heart So I am highly disappointed in that um Let's see here is the consistency of this one so it is thinner 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 um and it's it doesn't give me the same softness as the one before as a leave-in <laughs> as a conditioner it's it's cool it's cool it will be something um like you wash you condition I would condition when it let it sit maybe you rinse and then put the conditioner back in and use it as a leave-in so that's how I would use it um as far as me using it a lot like to the gym and, and places and using it as a leave-in mm, I probably won't mm -mm. one because of the smell two because it's it's on my hair it's thinner it's noticeably thinner and it's not as moisturizing as I would like it to be so um this one I'm just gonna have to learn to work with it and use it as a conditioner slash leave-in whereas with this one um primarily just a great all-around leave-in you know it says daily conditioner but it was a great leave-in another um reason why i liked it so much is because um my mom is going through chemo and um this was one of the one leave-in conditioners that really worked great on her hair um so we would use a little bit of this 
um, let it sit and she you know she's not into having wet hair and just walking around you know she just let it sit on damp hair or whatever and then we'll take a little bit of the um, Comet Biologics Amla and Olive Heavy Cream and smooth that in and my hair my mother's hair was moisturized it wasn't heavy just moisturized she normally has uh, 3C hair 3C fine hair and um, yeah this is the one that worked for her so again sad to see it go for that for that reason alone because um it's hard to find stuff that works with chemo patients and my mom's hair and it's just a little tough to find a replacement for for that so um do i like the new beauty curls i like it i just it's just that i can't use it as I was using the other one so it's not really um, a replacement leave-in for me it's just another conditioner for me to use so yeah I like it it's a nice conditioner um, I don't really like leaving it in my hair one the smell I prefer the strawberry that's just my own personal opinion I prefer the strawberry one um, would I buy it again if it was a different smell <laughs> I probably won't buy this one again. I already have my staple conditioners, my staple daily conditioners, and it's 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 a nice product. Um, if you want to try it, I highly recommend to try you trying it. If you haven't found your staple conditioner, your Holy Grail conditioner, um, yeah, this is gonna be it's it's up there. Please believe it is up there. It's top ten, definitely one of my top tens. Um, I'm just so disappointed because I can't use it as a leave-in. But as a conditioner, yeah, it's up there. Top 10s, definitely. Um, yeah. Even compared as this, um, as a conditioner, it probably wouldn't make my top 10 list. It makes my top 2 as a leave-in. So, yeah. I'm going to miss you. Hi, how you doing? So, yeah. <laughs> um, that's where I am with that. So, I am off now to my journey to find another leave-in that works well for both myself and my mom. Um, it's probably going to be the Kamaza Care Califia or perhaps the Coils by Nature Shea Aloe. Yeah, those are probably going to be my, my leave-ins of choice now. So, yeah, darn it. So I will talk to you guys later. Bye.